some years after the stroke, I began to want to give back. I had had the opportunity to make a remarkable recovery. And I thought, I need to give back. So I approached the rehabilitation center where I was treated and told them I, began, I, would, I wanted to begin to talk with patients and to help them find motivation to recover. About five years ago, I started a regular program of teaching and motivational speaking. And I've been doing that every couple of weeks in all kinds of venues ever since. Out of that, the book developed. I never thought I would write a book. I couldn't imagine how people would discipline themselves to write books. How you could sit down in front of the computer day after day after day to write a book for months and months and months and months and months. I couldn't see myself doing this. Even though I was doing regular teaching and there was a lot I wanted to share, a lot of things that I could say to people that would help them and do help them, I never thought I'd write a book. Then one day, I was invited to write the foreword for somebody else's book. And so I did. Something in doing that opened a door in my head. And my book reached out of that door, grabbed me, sat me down in front of the computer, and wrote itself in a month. I'm not kidding. In a month. I could barely get up to get a cup of tea. The book simply wanted to be written. That book now is used by people who have had strokes, people who have had acquired brain injuries, people who have had breast cancer, people who have had Bell's palsy. It's used here, it's used in Brazil, it's used in Europe, it's used in Australia. The book has found many, many, many uses. Just recently, I heard from someone who told me that the lessons in the book are now being used with people who have lived through Katrina in New Orleans. It's been wonderful talking with you. If there is anything further that I can share with you, if you have any questions, or there's anything else I might do, please visit me at my website, www.healingintopossibility.com. Thank you.